Welcome to Daisy Nicks Recipes and DIY Crafts. Hi everyone, today we're going to make a little rollerball perfume. It's got an oil base and they are just fantastic. I absolutely love them and they're very handy to take in your handbag. So what we're going to need is a sweet almond oil or an oil carrier and some essential oils. I've used this perfume before and I really, really like it. I've called it LME Fresh due to the fact it has LME in it, which is a lovely grounding and balancing essential oil. We also have lavender, lemon balm, which is also called Melissa, and lily oil. Ingredients. 5 millilitres of sweet almond oil or a carrier oil of your choice. You'll need 4 drops of lavender essential oil, 5 drops of elemis essential oil, 2 drops of lemon balm essential oil, often called Melissa, and 1 drop of lily essential oil. You'll also need a 5 millilitre little roller bottle. Now, if you're making like five or more of these, it's probably a good idea to use a jug and pre-mix it. But today, I'm just making the one, so I'm going to pour it straight into my container. So I'll start with my sweet almond oil. This is a great carrier oil for massages and skincare. So I've just put a little bit of oil in the bottom of there to start with. Then I'll put my essential oils in. I'll start with my lavender. So I'm going to put four drops of lavender essential oil into my container. There we go. This is a five milliliter container. And we'll be using 10 drops of essential oil in all. Now the LME, I'm going to put three drops in. It's a really, really nice oil. And of the lemon balm, I'm going to put two. There we go. And one of the lily essential oil. There we go. And then two more drops of your LME. There we go. Now when you're using essential oils, always look up each of the essential oils and read about their properties and what they are good for and if there's any safety precautions on your oils. Then pop the lid on. And then just mix from side to side to incorporate your oils. Um, you can use it straight away, but it is nice just to leave it to settle about 24 hours. Here's the finished scent. It smells absolutely amazing. It's got a really nice flowery, fresh smell with a little bit of citrus and it's really, really floral. Very nice, very girly and one of my favourite scents. I hope you've liked my video. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more DIYs. Thanks for watching.